I mean, talk that's to a party right there. Um, um, this is not going to be that video. <sighs> Let me catch my breath. Hold on. Without further ado, let's jump into it. We're going to do our March favorites. Now, I didn't think I was going to have that much, but I do. So I need to hurry up and get started. So, um, the first thing I'm going to talk to you guys about is um, in one of my hauls, I had showed you this CVS um, Beach Guard Clear Spray. Um, it's 70, SPF 70, and I said it's comparable to, um, I, they compared it to Neutrogena, and I was saying how much I loved Neutrogena product of this sunscreen, and I loved the smell and everything like that. Well, I was wrong. It wasn't Neutrogena. It was the L'Oreal that I was obsessed with um, last summer, and it's the L'Oreal um, Paris Advanced Sun Care um, Invisible Protector um, 50 SPF. This smells really good. It's not like a coconut smell. It's just a fresh smell, and I really like it. Um, this is, um, I still like this. I still really, really like this, so I don't want to steer you guys wrong. Maybe it is comparable to Neutrogena, but um, I'm not a fan of the smell. But I am a fan of how it goes on, how it absorbs into the body. It doesn't leave you feeling greasy. Um, and I like that it's SPF 70. Um, so I really like this. I would definitely, if you're trying to save a couple bucks, because the smell isn't stinky. It's not like nasty. It's, I mean, it smells a little bit like sunscreen, but um, definitely like this. So um, if you're trying to save some bucks, get you some CVS um, Beach Guard Clear Spray. The next thing I want to talk to you guys that I'm like obsessed with right now is the Power Crunch Energy Bar. This was something that one of my friends, she knows I work out. Um, she was just like, Oh, have you tried these? Um, when you have a sweet tooth, it, it tastes just like a nutter butter. It is so yummy, and it has um, 13 grams of protein. It's got 5 grams of sugar. It's really, really good when you have a sweet tooth or you just want to eat something, but you don't want to feel guilty about it. I'm, like, obsessed with this. This granola, French vanilla. It's, it doesn't even have to be French vanilla. Like, any of the Kodiak granola-type oatmeals that they have um, are just so delicious. Um, it has 270 calories, it's got 8 grams of fat, it's got 41 grams of carbs, it's got 13 grams of sugar, it's got 10 grams of protein, it's got 4 grams of um, fiber, I don't know if I said that already. Um, I This is something I love, 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 love. I look forward to it. I have it every morning with a little bit of water and a splash of almond milk. Um, sometimes I'll get crazy and I'll put like some berries in there and stuff like that. I really, really like this. It gives me energy. Like today, I had this with some egg whites and some um, vegetables. Not in it, but like on the side. And it'll hold me out for a while. So, really yummy. Downy Stoppables. Um, it's a scent booster. You just put a little bit of this in your washing machine with your, with your laundry. And it just kind of enhances the smell. Now, when I first... Hmm. When I first got this, it's a little pricey. It smells really good. When I first got this, my intentions were to only use this on bedding, linens, and um, and towels. But my husband and I, we work out so much. And our clothes, even though we try to let them dry before we put them in the dirty clothes, we try to, like, you know, our sweat. I know it sounds nasty, but yes, we get really sweaty. And so we'll try to let, let everything air out. Um, before we just throw it with the rest of our dirty clothes, but sometimes you know it's in the dirty clothes for a minute and Smells happen. And I use this on everything now So now I'm gonna have to go to Costco and get the Costco brand or Costco size of this because I love this stuff It's great. It's fantastic. It's about is this JBL speaker. And I'm gonna turn it on for you guys Oh, So pretty so um I, this is a Bluetooth speaker. It attaches to, and it lights up. Look at that. I mean, that's a party right there. Um, it, it's a Bluetooth and it connects to my iPhone. And it, there's so many things about this that I love. I love that it's splash proof. I love that um, the lights. <laughs> I love that it's Bluetooth. And I love the quality. Now, I'm going to be honest, the quality of like the bass isn't as great as like my Bose speaker. But I love this. It's really nice and loud. It's very easy to put in my bag and just go and take it with me um, to the river when we went to Wimberley. That was, this is what we took. And I wasn't worried like if it got splashed, it was going to get ruined. It's got like 10 hours of battery. Um, there's so many things. I, 
I just got it um, three or four weeks ago, so I haven't gotten to use everything with it, but so far so good. I love it. I love, love, love. And you can hear it like from the other side of the river. Um, when we went to the river, like the sound was really good. It, it traveled really well. So if you're thinking about getting this, it's great. Especially with summertime coming up, we're going to be by the pool. Oh, I got super close to you guys. This Missler, Missler um, cleansing water is by Garnier. Gar Garnier. And so when I first, I'm going to be honest, when I first used this, I did not like it. I saw a couple other YouTubers talking about it. And I was like, oh, I have to go find it. It took me forever to find it. Now you can find it really easily. But um, this one is the waterproof one. Or it removes like waterproof mascara. Um, it does a really good job of it. It doesn't remove everything, but it does a really good job of it. And um, when I, like I said, when I first tried this, I didn't like it. It took me a couple months. before, or like I tried it a couple times and I was like, mm, I'm just not liking it. And then I kind of revisited it. As a matter of fact, it was going to make one of my like not favorites. But then I realized I was using too much. And just a little bit goes a long way. And I really love this because I have really dry skin. And this does not dry my skin out. So I um, I just put some of this on a little cotton round and remove a lot of my makeup. And then I'll go and cleanse it with another cleanser. Um, the other thing I want to talk to you guys about is um, I love um, Nivea cream. Like the cream. The thick, thick cream. I have, Like I said, I have really dry skin. I like how hydrating the Nivea cream is. And, um, it's, the little tub I get is about that big, and it's like five, uh, five dollars, seven dollars, whatever, depending where you go, um, for that little thing. I was at Trader Joe's and I found this moisturizer. It's, um, unscented herbal blend with aloe. Um, it's a moisturizing cream for, for extra dry formula. And I have been loving this, and this is only like three dollars, so I'm a really big fan of this. It has pretty much replaced my Nivea. I like the pump on it, and I love that I just put it on, and I don't have to reapply lotion um, all day long and stuff like that. So um, it does kind of have like an earthy smell, but it, I mean, it doesn't like, it kind of, it wears off, it goes away. My last, last, last favorite as far as like products go is this um, water bottle. Now, this I got from like, Marshalls or something like that. It's got 32 ounces it holds and it's my favorite color paint or uh, pink purple but um, I really like it because I Can instead of carrying a whole bunch of little water bottles and like throwing those out and being wasteful I can put 32 ounces of water in here, and it's a goal that I finish this by noon or by lunchtime and then I'll refill it and then I will have a goal to finish it by dinner and then hopefully get another couple, like maybe 16 ounces after dinner in or like with workouts and stuff. And since I've used, started using this, I literally have no problem getting through two of these in one day. And I usually go through two and a half um, because I'll usually drink like half during one, of my, during, during one of my workouts. I'll usually drink half of this. So I'm a really big fan. If you're trying to get your water in, I've... I would recommend getting a water bottle like this. It doesn't have to be this brand, but it's a great size. You're not being, like, I always, if you do this, I'm so sorry, but I'm always like, why are they walking around in the gym with a big old gallon of water? Like, it just looks crazy. It looks uncomfortable. This fits in the fat part of my, um, of my, what do they call it? Where you, in the car where you put your drinks at and stuff like that. It fits in there, not a problem. And so, ah! But yeah, if you need, if you're struggling to get your water in, definitely, this is like the perfect size. The perfect size. Get it. Okay? Drink your water. It helps you. We are going to talk about an obsession I have right now. Renee Vasquez, who's my husband, if you're watching this, you're going to be rolling your eyes right now. I already know, I, I know he's rolling his eyes right now if he's watching this because he knows what I'm about to say. I am obsessed with Christian Guzman. And it's not even like, oh, he's so cute or whatever. No, that's not the case. So, I mean, he's I mean, he's a cute guy, but not like, oh my god, like he's so hot, whatever. I am obsessed with his videos. Um, I recently changed my workout routine. Um, for those of you guys that don't know, I was predominantly like working and doing CrossFit type movements. I've been doing CrossFit for we have a CrossFit gym in our garage. 
Um, I've been doing it for like two or three years now. I've had a lot of great results for it from it. But um, doing CrossFit for that many years, I was just kind of getting bored. I wanted to change up my routine. So I went and got a gym membership and started working out again, like in a gym setting. And so I've definitely changed my workout like completely like what I'm do what I from what I have been doing and so even though I have worked out in the gym before I'm familiar with the equipment I'm familiar with like the whole Arnold pumping iron whole thing because of my husband um I it's been a long time and so I really enjoy his videos because of the content I enjoy um the information that he gives when he does go through the workouts he'll talk about um, little tricks and tr um, traits that maybe like I forgot or you just don't think about or you don't even know about and so I really 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 enjoy his videos for that reason um, but it's getting a little ridiculous like he did like a grocery haul the other day and he was like he went to HEB which is a grocery store that we have here locally and um, he was like this weekend when my husband and I went to HEB, I was like, oh, Christian Guzman says, get this. Oh, he said to do this. And then my husband's just like, really, babe? He's got really good information in there. And um, not only that, just the quality of the footage that he gets. Um, he has this guy, Jovan, who does like all his editing and just some amazing things. I mean, if not to watch it for anything else, if you don't work out and you're like, mm, what are you talking about? Um, watch it for like just how they do um, these angles and these clips and just the quality of work that they're putting into it you can really see and it's really amazing it's very motivating every time I watch one of his videos I'm like why am I not making more videos why am I not doing this I'm gonna go buy a new camera um, but um, anyways I'm done ranting about that I just really really like his videos and if you guys haven't checked him out you should because I don't really see a lot of females do that in their videos besides Honey Buns. If you guys watch her she kind of goes into more depth which I really 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 like her as well and her name is Honey Buns. I'll put her um, description down in the box um, but it's I don't see a lot of females and it could be that I'm just not looking in the right place. I don't see a lot of females that go into like like when you're doing your bicep curl I like to do this and this is why I do this or when you're doing your squat do it like this and this is why I like to do it like this is what works for me but they kind of give you tips I don't see a lot of that you'll see their workouts which are amazing beautiful and they're super strong and it's just super motivating but sometimes knowing like little tips and tricks is also um, very helpful and something that I enjoy that is it guys I hope this video isn't too long I really really I feel like I hit a wall so it seems like I went like um I don't know I got like a million things on my mind but um anyways thank you guys so much for watching I really appreciate your support if you like this video please give it a thumbs up um please make sure you subscribe and I will see you guys in the next one